Okay, this how-to video is going to show you how to use the, the shadow mode, which again is a really useful feature in AUKAD and Allegro PCB Editor, and uh, it gives you the ability to kind of help you trace nets through a board that's that's been pre-routed. Um, so we've got an icon up here, shadow toggle, so we can toggle the shadow mode on, and you can see what happens is, in general, most of the board then goes into this kind of this shadow display, de-highlighted display, uh, and you can control the, the visibility of this. So if we go to the the colors display color visibility menu and we look at the display folder we've got the shadow mode option up here so if we um, have a look at some of these settings we can obviously change the brightness or the dimness level by just adjusting this this little drag handle here to come down I mean obviously you want this set to be quite a, a dark level I mean you can have it almost almost off completely that allows you to kind of this is what you won't see um, when you're looking for a net. We've also got this dim active layer, which will then give us the ability to kind of have this active layer, whether it's displayed or, or dimmed or not with the rest of the design. We want it dimmed in this moment. So once we've got the board in that mode, then what we want to do is we can use things like the assign color or the highlight menu to, to be able to highlight the nets that we want to trace. So we'll go into the highlight mode. And again, we can just come in and just, just pick a trace that we wanted to highlight. And if we look now, you can obviously see quite clearly, you can see where that trace is running through the board. We can also use the, the find by name filter, which is a really useful function. So if I wanted to look for specifically maybe a match group, I could select the match group and then click on more, find the match group that I'm looking for and then hit apply. And it would then just highlight that match group so I know they're the important nets that I'm worried about. There's some differential pairs that I need to make sure from a match length uh, are there. And we can just toggle this mode kind of on and off just to quickly see the nets that we're looking for.